In the faded light, you touch my body. I can feel your hands on my skin. Hey there, everyone. Welcome back to Stay Happy Vlogs. If you're new, what's up? I'm Marissa. So today, I'm gonna be trying something that's I've I've seen it tested a few times here on YouTube already, but I just got it in the mail. So I'm gonna be testing out the Kim Kardashian West by Kylie Cosmetics collection. Ooh. Comes with this little note, and this is how it looks. It's gorgeous. I'm like. Mm, okay, so I'm gonna do swatches and show you guys and tell you honestly what I think about it. I won't lie about anything. I just wanted to do this because first of all, I'm excited to try these. Second, because some people have different opinions on things and that's okay. Some things might not work on some people but might work on others. So it's always good to, you know, do swatches so people can see. So yeah, let's get into this swatch video. So this is how the box looks when you get it. It also comes with this little note on the back and it says, Hey guys, I hope you love the Kim Kardashian West Kylie collab. I'm so excited for you to try my four fave nudes. Have a surprise coming soon. XOXO Kim Kardashian West. So there's four colors in this box and they're creme or cream liquid like lipsticks. These don't claim to be to dry down. They don't claim to be long wearing. So... They're just kind of like a creamy lipstick, so I'm excited. There's a lot of pretty nudes. Nudes are actually my favorite thing to wear, so let's do it. So there's four shades in here. I'm going to take them all out. This first one here is Kimberly. Swatch it on the back of my hand. It feels pretty, like yeah, creamy for sure. One is Kim. These look actually pretty pigmented. From the swatches I've seen, I didn't think so, but. So that one's more of a pinky peachy. The next shade is Kiki. I think this one I'm most excited for. This one's more of that pinky color. Last one is Kimmy. Ooh, this one's dark, darker, right there. So as you can see, those are all the colors. The darker ones, I'm not sure how I'm going to like them, but, you know, you never know. You never knew. So the first one I'm going to put on my lips is Kimberly. Be fitting to use a Kylie mirror, so I'm going to use this one. I'm actually going to go on the Kylie website and look at what the colors are, so I'm not telling you guys the wrong thing, just to make sure, like, the shade tone. Okay, so a little bit more on it. So... This is a sheer to medium coverage and can be built to a desired lip intensity. It's a unique creme formula, contains moisturizing and hydrating ingredients that glide on for a luxurious look. Okay, so first I'm going to be trying Kimberly. And Kimberly, it says it's a true nude color. So let's try this one out. Oh, whoa. So it's a little, not streaky, but it feels moisturizing for sure. So that's this color. I like it. Yeah, I actually really like that. Um, what I would say is it's a little um, streaky or I don't even know how to explain it. It's not streaky, but... It has no um, smell either, like the other Kylie liquid lipsticks, which I like. So I like this color. I didn't think I would like it because I'm not like this kind of nude, like I'm not usually into this color, but I do like this one. I'm gonna take it off. Okay, they come off so easy. So I'm trying Kim next, and this is a peachy nude. Oh, this is gorgeous. I notice is it is kind of thick 
so I really don't need that much. So I would just maybe tap my finger on it a little bit. But yeah, this is Kim. I like this one. I like it. The next one that I'm going to be trying on is Kiki, and this is a pinky nude. This one I'm excited for. This is a color I see myself wearing the most. Okay, so I'm pretty obsessed with these colors. Mm. Oh, I love this one the best. I love this one. It's so like nude natural but gives you like a flush of pink and it's beautiful feels the same this one's not as like streaky like I said it wasn't streaky but maybe I put it on too thick so that's why it maybe look a little patchy last shade Kimmy this one is described as a deep nude so let's try it this one has a little bit of a This one has a flavor. This one has something going on. So that's Kimmy. This one has a little bit more of a smell to it. I don't know if maybe I'm just weird and I can like smell this one a little more than the other ones, but it's still the same formula. Nice, thick, and super creamy like it says. So I think it lives up to the name. I don't think it gave any false accusations. I'm going to put a little bit of Kiki in the middle of this one because I like this one the best. So my final thoughts on this product is the colors are beautiful. The packaging, the matte finish, everything is just gorgeous. I think this was definitely worth it. The shipping took a week to get here. Not bad at all. I think it's definitely worth the money. You're getting four of these, and I believe it was 40, $48. I can't even remember the price. Below 50. I remember it was like below 50. But these are definitely worth it. So these are approved by me, and usually sometimes I get dry lips, so I think these are gonna be really good for me. I'm gonna keep wearing these because. These are more up my alley. I'm not a big matte lip person. Um, but yeah, I really, really like this. Good job, Kim and Kylie. This was a great choice. Yeah, I recommend that you guys get it. And like I said, if you're a nude person and like nude lipsticks, definitely go for it. Beautiful. So that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any video requests, leave them down in the comments. I'm always open to any of your guys' suggestions. Subscribe to this channel if you aren't already. I post every Friday. Yeah. Give this video a huge thumbs up if you enjoyed it, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys.